Hi, welcome back or welcome to my cup of TV. I'm Jenny. I'm Erin. And Erin gets really excited when I say welcome to because she knows it's someone new. <laughs> but I know who it is and I'm so excited. I believe it's pronounced Le Seraphim. Uh, they are, yeah, new to us. I know that they're a girl group under Hybe or one of Hybe's you know what this means yeah <laughs> um so my experience of Le Seraphim so far is I've watched a couple of episodes of the Hype Game Caterers and they were on that mm. beautiful girls they seem like fun <laughs> <laughs> um and I've heard some of their songs at uh girl group club nights we we heard one and I was like that's so good. So the reason we're going to do them now is because we have a request from Gamer J Stewart. Hello. Hi. Uh, over on Patreon, he has requested Eve, Psych, and Bluebeard's White. Oh. To, yeah, but we're actually going to do three songs because sometimes with a new group, it's just nice to get a, yeah. a good few songs together and see how we feel about them. It's nice to have them on the playlist, like a little like batch yeah. of them, so you don't feel so starved. Yeah. Um, yeah, so we'll start with this one. Yeah. And then I've picked, at random, two other MVs, which is Easy and Perfect Night. Because Perfect Night is the one that I know that I've heard on TikTok. I think I used it on a TikTok as well, because I just really liked it. <laughs> I don't think that either of those is the one that I've... The other song of theirs I've heard a lot of is called Anti-Fragile. Yes. Oh, so that. I know more than one of theirs. So please remember to like, comment and subscribe. In the comments, uh, your recommendations for Le Seraphim. You know, tell us what we need to know about them. Who are they? How old are they? All that sort of thing. Everything. And please, when we start picking out outfits and stuff, please tell us where we can get them. <laughs> I wish I could look that cool. Wish I could roller skate. Oh! Oh my god. They look cool. I like oh, I like also yes. my cap. I like the attitude. <laughs> I feel like I've seen this choreo. I love the pop up. I love this bit of like. I know where I've seen this choreo. Cool. Sunny. <gasps> yes! Oh. Oh. <laughs> They have a set like, yes, yeah. girls, yes. Yeah. 
I connect with this message. Yeah. Oh, I liked that. <laughs> oh my god. Um, yeah. So, if you've watched our other reactions, especially girl group reactions, you'll know that I struggle with the really poppy, really girly stuff. I mean, I like some of it. It has its place. I enjoy it in certain moods, but I like to see women showing that they can do other stuff as well. You know, I'm not saying don't do that, but I. What I really loved about that is the styling. Yeah. They looked cool. Obviously the song, but the choreo. Mm -hmm. I can, I say I cannot stand. Again, it has its place. But when all the girl group choreo is very much just arms, aren't I pretty and delicate? I'm a bit like, these girls are trained dancers, let them dance. Um, and I feel like they did. I really liked that choreo. It was the the way the arms and the way they were moving that like very quick foot flicks. Yeah, I liked all the like boom, boom. But it was like, it, but it was too. Yeah. It, there was different bits of choreo because there were bits that like I say you could do. Yeah, I know what you mean. <laughs> but we could, you we can could attempt do it. that. Yeah. Like, do do. So that feels very much of like, you know, we you get your cutesy, which yeah, I'm. I do love you like that. The, that like I I love it. I, like, I I I eat it up. But I love that with this there was that. Okay, fine. Here's the bit you want, but like on our they did it with an attitude. Yeah, because even the bit where they had their hands out and it was a little, little bounce that yeah. could be very cutesy. But they were doing it with an attitude that meant it wasn't. It was cool. I am so thrilled that one line in a song that I've heard a few times told me the attitude and seeing this now I'm like yes do you know what these are how I felt they were going to be yeah. I think we both when we, we both read the same line I am not a doll yes. and we were like yes <laughs> thank you I won't hide my emotions I'll frown if I want yeah. to I like I will, I'll be myself or whatever that thing said. And I felt that the whole idea of like my heart's beating and the boom 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 it's I'm a human being. I'm yeah. I'm gonna have like say frowning, I'm gonna have bad days, I'm gonna have good days, I'm not gonna get everything right. I'm I can't perform like a doll. Yeah. <laughs> I don't have to live up to your expectations. Yeah. I can just And what it said be was me. I won't hide myself. Yes. Which is so true for idols in particular. I, for women. Yeah. I don't, I don't have to put on a facade for you because me being emotional or having an opinion or feeling a certain way makes you uncomfortable. Yeah. I don't just mean other men. I just mean other people yeah. in general. And gosh, that's a strong yeah. punch. And yeah, they were like, it's forbidden. And when they were in the two rooms, there was the girl that had, like, the the spiked apple. Yeah. And it was very much, like, I was, like, a bit of a deeper tone. Yeah. That the song was in. And then you'd flick to the room and they'd be, like, do, do, do. Like, it was just really yeah. nice polarising. So that's, like, your Eve kind yeah. of section apple, yeah. of it. And... and I just love the, you know, the line, you know, I wish for what's forbidden. Again as an idol, as a woman, it's that, no, I don't want to do what you want me to do. I want to do something else. I want, 
And as someone who you tell me not to or that I can't do something, <laughs> that is exactly what I will do. I respect that. <laughs> yeah, that felt like like a little bit of an anthem for you or for anyone that needs that needs not that you need the the green light. That's like the anthems tell you, like you are you you are your yeah. own green light. You can say when when you want to do things and when you don't. Yeah. Oh god, I loved it. I loved the outfits that kind of slightly emo grunge esque. Yeah. Like who didn't have like slightly ripped kind of baggy very, like, the chains. Yes. Yeah. Um I didn't get a good like close up look of all the outfits, but almost like band t shirts, but cropped, that sort of idea. Yeah, I think one of them said like rich on it and yeah. Yeah, I just, I wish I was cool enough for the aesthetic. Oh, me too. I, I wish love, I wish I had those tiny waists for the aesthetic. <laughs> I also love when they were in a line, they went through, and there was there was one of the girls was in the white top. Yeah. And was being, like, held back, and they, like, cut her. Yeah. Cut her free. You know, you could see it happening, and yeah. I was like, yes, do it. Do it do and in it, a way, that cutting her free, it can be, we do get a lot of songs about, um men and misogyny and you know but again the idea that women can also hold you back oh god yeah you know and that cutting free and not just women but friends friends are they a friend if they hold you back yes. but you know how are women i always want to say worse because you should know better yeah exactly <laughs> Oh, I'm so pumped for them. I'm going to say, I, I don't understand the title of the song. So it, I got... Eve makes sense. And then it was Psych. Yeah. But that to me is that like, Psycho, your Psyche, the way you think about things. Your narrative, I can't remember what the last Blue Beards, one. why? I don't, I, that I don't know. I'm sure people will let us know in the comments. Like you could, I could make it uneducated guess yeah. on the wife but maybe there's more to it but maybe i don't know about psych but women who have been vilified in history because think about it adam and eve she's the one who does wrong yeah bluebeard's wife i don't know if there's a story there oh like a uh, complaint with complete stretch but like Greek mythology there's like um, Psyche I can't think of what her like, like that storyline is but uh. there's stuff there I don't tell me I want to know I mean the women that are vilified naturally they weren't the one in a wrong you give me apples I'm gonna eat apples <laughs> <laughs> so it says official MV with Overwatch 2 which is a game isn't it oh is it I don't know so. We're not gamers, can you tell? <laughs> okay. I'd be that one. <laughs> <laughs> Donut in mouth and still reaching for something in the fridge. garage type beat isn't it oh, I need the cat ear yeah I think <laughs> oh. 
I like this line. Yeah. It's like, do you see why though? Even though it is a bit girlier, I I like that. It's that garage beat. It ha- yeah, it has the beat behind it. Um, the line, we're flawless and we're free. Yeah, I take that as obviously they're gorgeous. I can't see a flaw in them. Um, but that's through my eyes. But you know when you're with your friends and you're it, it's just you guys and you have that that flawless feeling because you're just you're raw in that vibe you're all in that zone and yeah. it's just almost like untouchable like there's nothing nothing can face you because you're all there you're all together and you've everyone has such busy lives but you've freed up that time like is it till 11 59 there's nothing no one else's problem it, you're just there you are in that moment yeah, I took it as because it comes after the line of there's no better feeling than when I'm dancing with my girls and then we're flawless, yeah, we're free. I took that as, you know, when you're just out dancing with your friends, you're in like this circle of trust where you're not even noticing there's other people there. Yeah. You are having your best time. So because you're with people you trust, you're not worried about how you look or how you're coming across because none of that matters because yeah. the people we, that you trust don't care about that. So you're just having, living your best life and just in that little bubble. I, I love those bubbles. They, they, the, the only you get, I feel like the less frequent you have the yeah. opportunity for, but it does, it's, it feels so weird that you're out, you go out, so there's lots of people around you, but you are just then. You section yourself your off without yeah. even realizing. It's, it's such beautiful moments that I don't think until you look back at them. Yeah that you realise how special they actually are. Oh, and it was all encapsulated within a song and... And I liked um, the whole, don't be blowing up my line. And like it says, I'll care at 11.59. It's almost like tonight is about me and my girls. Yeah. When I get to midnight, obviously this night is over. Then I have time for you. But right now, this is my girl time. It doesn't even need to... Yes, I do feel like it's... Yeah something like that but it could also just be like responsibilities are the problems mm, it's yeah. just dedicating this time for you just to to be in the moment be with your friends just enjoy yourself yeah and everything else can wait until this point i will have to come back down from reality yeah. but that's what makes those those times so special yeah okay. although i will say my nights don't end at midnight. They only started at 11. True. <laughs> the club, those club nights. <laughs> oh, I'm so excited. I hope by the time we get to like the next um, girl group oh, club yeah. night that we've got a good chunk of songs. and. Well, I believe Les Seraphim are very popular at girl group club night. I know they get requested a lot. Well, which I see why. I see why. Yeah, um, yeah I really enjoyed that. Oh. And a cool video with the yeah. characters. Like I said, that's me. A donut in your mouth while still reaching for more stuff from the fridge. Free tickets. Free for donut, donut tickets. Yeah. I liked that the characters weren't all perfect. They had, obviously, I don't know, I don't really understand 
what that part was specifically for, but just things like hair popping yeah. out or just like funny faces. That it, it just yeah, you don't have to be perfect yeah. to be flawless. Yeah. Loves it. Okay. So last one for today, easy. Oh, I'm sad this is the last one. You have now got stray kids easy in my head. <laughs> I mean, I do think that they give me the vibe that they could make it look so easy. Yeah. This is a new one. When's it from? Oh, yeah. Feb 20. February. This year. Mm. Oh. Might be why it was high on the list. Yes. Okay. I also like this. Yeah. Is this like the comeback? Oh my oh. god, I need that top. <gasps> oh. Devil horns. Yes. Was some of that like they're in a church? Yeah, there were several things there, like devil, like little horns. What a bit sacrilegious. Yeah, and there were two scenes where you had two women together in a way that seemed a little bit erotic. And there was another part. I now can't think of where I thought okay that would go against what a lot of religions so the things that pop to mind are obviously like the fangs very like yeah vampire undead the um electrocution in the bathtub yeah do you see what I mean it felt very boundary like it because was, it's all happening within a church 
Yeah. But then they're like battles to have had. And I think yeah. like, I can't remember all of the lines that I liked now, but it was very much um, like, oh, I make it look easy. But then they flipped and they were like, if you think I've had it easy, yeah, you you might want to think again just because I make it look that way. Yeah, it doesn't mean that it is, and it doesn't mean that it's been. Yeah. Like you know, you're you're having these these sort of battles and what have you. It was very interesting. I don't. I'm glad we did those them in that order. Yeah. I feel like we might be missing some bits. Yeah. For it. Like, there was... Yeah, I don't know. It, the sound was very cool. It was very... Um, oh, my God, where, what's the right word? Like, it just, like, lulled you in. Because I've still got... The hypnotic. See, yeah, in my head. Yeah, like it's luring you yeah. like to the dark side. But is it the dark side? I don't know. I um I just I really like from all three songs their attitudes. Yeah. They seem great. You see not strong young women. But not strong in a stay the fuck away from me way. <laughs> In a, I'm not going to take any shit way. It's kind of like, if I want to do this type of song, I'm going to do this. Yeah. But you can't box me in to it. Yeah. And the idea that I, maybe because when we look into boy groups more than we do the girl groups, I don't feel like I know their struggles. Yeah to getting to like debut point and whatever they these girls have like gone through to get there but I do feel like there is the expectation that they are expected to make it like it just easily fell in their lap or you know it just it all goes smoothly you don't hear so much I don't at least in the our scope that you hear as much of it and yeah that song was a bit like you know I also make it look that way get the impression and I know that it's because of when it comes to controversies with idols that they're also meant to give off this nicey nicey I'm such a nice person vibe which yes you should be a nice person but it doesn't mean you can't be strong and have boundaries and you know and I think maybe that's what they're trying to also push forward there being like I am a nice person but that doesn't mean I have to be constantly smiling yeah or I have to dance a certain way or I have you know I really liked the choreo in this one again yeah it was interesting I out of the three currently this one I wouldn't say is my favorite but it's intrigued me and I wonder if it was as well if you find out more out about it watch it a couple more times it's going to be a, a sneaky like a, like, I think it might be like a slow yeah. burn for me and I see I liked it but I think the other two I have heard before so it makes it easier to already yeah no I do for me. I, I do yeah I appreciate that but I really like them I like I like the way they are styled. I like the choreo they're doing. I like the sound. I like the attitudes. They look like girls I'd like. I want to hang out with. Yeah. And I did get that vibe from what I've seen of them in the game caterers thing. They're, they're quite fun. We need to watch game caterers. I also think Fraser lost a member. Is it them? Oh, I don't know. Is it them. I mean, you know when I'm done with this MV, when we're done with this reaction, I'm going to Google... We're going on, was it K-Profiles? and (laughs) Yeah, K-Profiles, I need to know, have they been to the UK? When are they coming to the UK? Do they have their own Instagrams? Yeah. How many albums? Is there a comeback soon? You know, just... The normal stuff we find out about everybody we know. (laughs) Casual, just super casual, obsessive Googling. Yeah. 
just surface level. Yeah. Yeah. I don't sit there in the the breaks that we have and read to you about their favourite yeah. colours or anything. Heights, birthdays. <laughs> yeah. MBTIs. <laughs> just a surface level scan. Super cash. Yeah. Super cash. Super cash. Yeah. If you think we don't know that stuff about you, you're wrong. <laughs> Oh, I'm so, I'm so happy. I I really enjoyed them. I love when we get any new music, but I just, I love it when it's the girls. Okay. Okay. So that was our reaction to Les Seraphim. Thanks for watching and we'll see you on the next one.